Hello guys, welcome back to uh, Torchlight 2. Um, if you haven't noticed, instantly, I'm uh, not joined by Jim Bob or Jordan today, because uh, he had his, something was saving to his O drive, which is his SSD, so it doesn't have much space. So um, what would happen, whoa, talk about a frame spike, what? The heck, Dexter? Dude. That was weird. Anyway. Um, so, uh, he decided that he wanted to, because, uh, to clear out his suit drive, he decided to just, uh, install Windows. I think I need to turn down my volume. Um, anyway, so he decided that he needed to reinstall Windows, and that got rid of all of his Steam games, which was probably a lot of space on his O drive, actually. So... He didn't feel like uh, just installing Torchlight 2 and recording today, so uh, this is probably just going to be a single player LP from now on, because I want to record and upload every day. Not just because I love this game, but also because like, I noticed the Augscast started doing it and stuff, and I do want people to watch this. I don't want people not to watch this, so I'd rather come out with a ton of content. Anyway. And, uh, yeah. So, this is most likely going to become a single player LP for now on. I'm not sure. It depends on whether, uh, uh, Jordan decides that he'd be okay with recording every day. Or we could talk about it. Maybe we could do, uh, like, if he could keep up with me in the story with this guy, then we could do that. But otherwise, it's just going to be a single player LP. Uh, so, yeah, that happened. Anyway, so let's see. I want to get that gold chest. So, let's go over here. There's nothing to kill here that'll give me, I'll check. Nope, can't open it, okay. There's the little duder over here. I always, like, I don't, ah, what's with these frame spikes, DX story? It's not like anything's like, really hard to render or anything, so stop spiking. Anyway, um, let's see, actually there's in my inventory. Holy crap. You gonna be okay now? Or do I like need to switch back to Bandicam? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna throw this stuff. Make sure, yeah. Throw that stuff in there and I'm just gonna see. Viara back to town. And uh, trying. Seriously! It like drops to like nothing. As you can see, I'm sure. Drops to like nothing when anything starts to happen. Um. Yeah. So if that continues to happen, I'm thinking I'm gonna be switching over to Bandicam again. Because right now I'm not happy with how DX Story is doing. Normally it does better than Bandicam, but if that's gonna happen every time I do something, yeah, I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. <sighs> well, see, Bandicam doesn't do that. I don't know why DX Story was doing that. Anyway, um, yep, so, here's Bandicam's gonna be the thing. Also, uh, I noticed from last recording it would cut out part of the loading screen, which is partially why I decided, thank you, which is why I decided to, uh, use DX story this time, but obviously that was not a very good idea because my frames kept on dropping. So I'm just going to be cutting out the loading screens because uh, it didn't make 
everything nicer and everyone happier, hopefully. Because then, yeah, because it's been cutting out the audio at loading screens, so. Don't want that to happen. I love that attack. It's so overpowered. It's the best thing ever. Okay. Mages, skeletons, skeletons, skeleton mages. Where's the boss? Is there no boss? Eh, there's no boss. Usually with that stuff, there's a, like, mini boss that shows up. Did I get that? Uh, shrine thingy, middle mabob, whatever. I think I did, eh? Let's go check. Yes. Okay, cool. <sighs> okay, I need to find a quest. There's that star, but I want to see if I can find someone else. Hmm. Oh, stone door. This is a thing. What's happened? And let's see. Does that. Is it literally just a bunch of dudes to fight? I was hoping that it'd be like somewhere to go. Yep. Oh, wait. No, there's a dude right here. Ah, oh, yes, this guy. Except. I need to go beat up a bunch of dudes, I think. Yeah, like open the stone doors or something, I forget. I just kind of beat the crap out of a bunch of guys when I was playing the single player. And that gate opens, so... Yeah, I know, yeah, I know. You, get, you have to let those guys out. That skill. Okay. I love how this is on battery and I'm like slaughtering everything. Apparently. On multiplayer, it's way harder. Either that or it's not veteran, but I'm pretty sure that it is. I'll have to check on uh, you. Okay. Uh, is there another door somewhere around here that I need to open? Stone door. I'll just kill these guys. So Ice. Shatter them with my awesomeness. Okay. Yeah, there we go. There's just the two of them. Just the two of us. I'm all alone. There's no one here beside me. Let's see. If you guys don't know what that's from, you need to watch Shrek. Doing bot, obviously. And. I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five. There. I don't have anything that I need. <sighs> Take a drink. Get a health robot. Beat the crap out of some guys. That's how we go. Go. Wow. Roll. Crushing rats under my feet. Boots. Feet. Heels. I can't talk. Okay, let's see. Electric ring. There are a ton of sarcophaguses. Well, actually, there aren't very many for, like, a giant tomb crypt thing. For a giant, like, crypt, they're, like, not. Normally, they'd be, like, mining the walls IRL. But this isn't IRL, so... Uh, it was IRL, I don't think I'd have a problem either. Like Anyway. Oh, need to beat the crap out of that guy. Some urns. And these dudes. Blight slugs. Interesting. Beat the crap out of some more urns. Pick up some more loot. Beat the crap out of some more guys. Oh look, it's like I'm playing Torchlight too. Okay. Let's see. What's down here? Oh, more urns to smash. I am shocked. Amazed. Slightly embarrassed. That guy was really easy. Oh, look, so was that guy. Oh, look, I just crushed another rat. 
Oh look, my commentary is being weird. Okay, let's see. Ooh, two-handed. Exciting. I wonder if it's any decent. Probably not. In my experience, you have to get to like a certain well, usually to find loot that's actually relevant to you, you have to be in a place that is either slightly higher than what you're supposed to be doing, or you are just barely the right level to be doing it. Uh, yeah, no, this is definitely not. As soon as I meet one of the mini-boss dudes, you can tell. See? Normally I'd just, like, walk through this guy and not have to worry about healing at all. Admittedly, he's pretty easy anyway, but... You know, you know. Okay, let's go. Kill those dudes. Those little slime dudes are just a pain in the butt. I hate guys like that. They're just like, oh yeah, I have to just smash you. You're not really good for anything else. Other than annoying me. Which is honestly probably their point, but you know. Still annoying. Okay, losing. Whatever the crap that bar is, need to go hit things. Oh, look, something to hit. Get hit. I'll go hit these things as well. Up uh, here, get hit, bro. I'm gonna hit you as well. And then you. And then you. And then you, after opening that sarcophagus, I'll let my head hit you, apparently. I love the combat in this game. It's pretty easy, but it's fun and pretty satisfying. Ooh, I just got a skull thing. My inventory is full. Kidding me. Whatever. My inventory is full. So I need to up with some more dudes so that I can clear my inventory out. Does that make sense? Okay. Pick up some gold. Do that. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need those. That. Ooh. No, the other one does health. Um. Okay. That's way better. Okay. Uh, ooh. Unidentified. Very slow attack speed. Nope. Uh, nope. Nope. Uh, wait. These ones... Nope. Nope. Mmm... Yes. I think... Yeah. Okay, nope. 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 And nope. 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 Yeah, this is pretty much what I do. <laughs> I sit here and say, nope. Nope. Mm, if I had a blood thing, that would be good, but no. Definitely no. No. No, no. And no. Yes. Whoa! Whoa! Seventeen... Yeah, it's enough to make it better than what I have. Well, it's already better than what I have. I mean, like, 51 health is nowhere close to over doubling my armor. Um... That's crap. Okay. And I want to hold on to this. Ooh. Okay, I won't put it in yet, but I will definitely... Oh, wait. Yeah, no, I'll put it into the pants. Actually. Dexterity. Oh. 45 dexterity. That's going to take me a while. And 22 focus isn't going to take long at all, but 45 dexterity. Eh. I guess I'll say no. They're just really good. I would definitely use them later. I'm trying to think. 
I might hold on to them, go back to town, and throw them in my community chest thing. And see if they're any good for my other guy. Yeah, I'll hold on to them. And this, let's see what I can put it on. What am I not going to be getting rid of soon? Actually, what does it do? 30%, plus 30% damage to secondary targets, eh. Uh, this has plus 12, but I'm almost already better than those. Belt, I just upgraded. And... Mm, you know what, really, I can just put it into whatever, and then I can just recover it later. If I'm gonna get rid of whatever it is that I'm gonna get rid of. Uh, 2.2 health, I'll just put it on my chest plate for now. Okay. You... Uh, how many identify scrolls do I have? I'll get you to buy... No, no. Two of those. Yep. Okay. Your pet has departed. Let's go. Smashy, smashy urns. Okay. Eating the top out of these annoying little sluck do sluck. Seriously. Seriously. I can't talk that much. Like, slug. It's not that hard. It is not that hard. Not oh, more urns. Urn to smirsh. There we go. Okay, let's go up here. Run over here. Smash these dudes. Holy crap. Smash. Die. One. Go. Dead. Thank you. Okay. Do, 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 do. Why did I do that? I didn't mean to. Okay. <sighs> My commentary is really boring. It's really hard to commentate a game like this, I just have to say. Like, without another person here, like, holy crap, dude. I'm just kind of like sitting here smashing dudes. I don't know what to talk about. I could talk about the smashing dudes, but. I've already talked about the fact that I like the combat. Um, uh, yeah. Like the combat, like the game as a whole. Killing those dudes. Like, seriously. I don't know. It's easier to commentate when you have a friend around. Yay! Let's go, Viola. Let's kill some more dudes. Kill shamblers. Okay, there we go, that's good. Oh, and look, I'm gonna smash you in the face as well, because I can. I smash people in the face as well. Stop beating on, like, my pet or whatever crap you're beating on. Okay. What is with these infernal ones? Like, they just move fast and do like the crap all the time, from what I've noticed. Not that I've been paying much attention to what damage they do to me. But, you know. Let's get this gold. Smash your shields and hit you in the face. Oh, and look! Are you... Yeah, I thought so. Big boss, dude. You are going down. Because I have a ridiculous amount of these available. Oh, look, you're dead. And so is everyone else. Actually, everyone was already dead. But, I mean, you're dead again. So, yeah. That's a thing. Oh, and this is a dude who is now dead. Again. Again. Okay. Die, uh, peoples. Well, that'd be hilarious, actually. You're fighting the undead, and there's someone that makes the, uh, like, resurrects the undead. So they're dead again, again. I mean, yeah, they're dead again, again. Uh, I was thinking that I'd failed completely and not, like, alive again again, but no. No, if I had said that, I would have been failing even more. So, yeah, that's a thing that happened. I really should be playing this on a harder difficulty. But then if I 
played it on a harder difficulty, I'd die all the time. It's interesting, this game. It's like, yeah, either you die a lot or you don't die a lot. Like, really. Okay, let's uh, have this. Come on, noob. I want the sarcophagus. Thank you. Short cannon. Gold. Oh, the gold's on the ground down there. Darn it. Okay, let's see if I can get through to this boss before too long. Smash. I bet you he's like not immune. I'm pretty sure that those guys are not exactly easy to kill with fire. Which means what I'm doing is completely retarded. It's the one thing about the engineer is that all of my special attacks tend to be based on fire. Well, the ones that I use at least, usually. And uh, as soon as you come up against someone who is impervious to fire, you're a little bit useless. Okay, let's see, is this... I'm trying to remember, this might be the room to the boss. In which case I need to double back a little bit and grab some stuff. Or, yep, it is. Okay, I need to double back a bit and get some stuff. I thought I remembered this. Okay. That's actually something that I really like about multiplayer. Is that... I can make it so that it has a uh, random train generation. It's normally single player doesn't. I don't know if you can set it to do that. I might want to look into that. You have become Yay! More I have become more experienced. That's exciting. Okay. I need to go over this way. Walk through here. Over here. Actually... If I don't do it, um, like, random generation, then it will be less of a blind walkthrough, because I've already played, like, at least 12 hours of this game, probably, as my other engineer, so that would work. I don't know. I'll think about it, figure it out. You guys will know, ex will know next episode, so whatever. You guys will find out tomorrow. Okay, let's get down here. Break some more urns. Oh, there's a chest. Is it a mimic or a chest? Yeah, it's a chest. Ah, that's why it's not a mimic. Interesting. These guys are insanely easy. Which makes sense, actually. Skeletons would probably be the easiest thing to fight. So you just, like, punch them hard and they all shatter. Like, not exactly intimidating. The fact that they're a walking skeleton would be kind of intimidating, but apart from that, I don't think of them as very scary at all, really. It's just like walking stacked bones that you can knock over easily. Again, I accidentally right clicked. What is wrong with me right now? Whatever. Let's go over here, fight the boss. Bossy dude. Bossy dude. Actually, funny story. When I was playing the player engineer, I got to like close to where the boss was, and uh, then I discovered that I needed to. Uh, I opened a chest and I needed to uh, like refill my inventory and stuff. So I was doing that. I sent my pet back to town, and then the boss just like randomly. I guess he got sick of waiting for me, so it had jumped down to me, which was hilarious. I'm just like chilling there and suddenly this boss comes down and then of course because I'm playing on normal I just beat the crap out of the thing instead of like being freaked out I was just like oh hey it's the boss oh look you're dead so yeah uh, ugh yeah if you guys get this game I very highly suggest that you do not play on normal unless you're not good at the game which could be a thing I don't know no it's a trap oh no Let's go in here. Okay, that's not somewhere that I go. This is something that I move and then I beat the crap out of these dudes. I want the dead. Oh, come on. Run. Oh, dead. Okay, there we go. Oh, there we go. There's Mordox. Hello, Mordox. My old nemesis. Very, very, very old nemeses. 
Oh, I had a health bar. Smooth. Seriously, just move out of my way. I need to beat up more docks, actually. Get out of my way. Seriously. He loves his stuff. That is good to know. I won't mess with your stuff, as well. But I will mess with you. Because you are a massive pain in the butt. Thinking critically. Oh, I'm supposed to hit my hits. Cool. Smash you with fire damage because you only do poison damage. Oh, shoot. You have perished. He just like stomped the crap out of me. Dude. I was just chilling there, not paying enough attention to my health. And suddenly, boom, I was dead. Apparently, bosses are the only difficult thing on veteran. Because, well, and the overwhelming amount of other dudes kind of helps too, yeah. Uh, let's see. Come on, smash. Oh, smash. Yeah, barf on me, bro. Try barfing on me. I'm gonna smash you. I will smash you with fire. I will burn you alive, Mordox. Even though you're undead, so I'll burn you alive again. You have completed Not again. I'll burn you alive dead. There we go. That's how it works. I'm killing these guys dead. And I'm not killing them dead. They're dead, so I'm killing them dead. Because that makes perfect sense, right? Right. Oh, look at this gold and these chests. Oh, no, it wasn't these guys. It was, um... Yeah, no, it was the other boss that Jordan and I did, not this guy. The, uh, skeleton boss, dude. That was pretty funny. I was just kind of chilling, sorting my inventory, and he's like, Hey, I'm gonna try to- It was, like, level, like, 15, and it was, like, a level 6 dungeon or something. Hey, it was hilarious. You feeling uh, a little lucky? See. Ooh. Level 20, 45 strength, eh, possibly, because then I can get One-Eyed Willy's other eye and throw it on here, and this does a lot more damage, same attack speed. Um, I'm thinking yes. Yes, there we go. Okay. I will sort my inventory and everything off camera, and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe, if you or whatever you want to do. If you liked the video, it'd be great if you liked, favorited, and or subscribed. But anyway, yep, I will see you next time. Bye!